flying Dutchman. Six cylinders, two less than everyone else. He's still saving up. If he gets a podium today, he might be able to buy another couple of cylinders. <laughs> so uh, I'll get a quick one. No, no, we're not going to get that opportunity. Spooler up. Ruben Hoxima, Jacob off the line. He winds it up, grabs all the beast he can and slingshots it out of the way. Ruben Rockstar Hoxima, the man who used to crawl around the track here when he first got here, but now look at him fly. Oh, He's really? Oh, but a gravy. He took another chunk out of that island and it doesn't slow him down. He doesn't care. No, what, what not, stay not. He just kept up it. I love his skills. Cost him a little bit of time, but who cares? Let her go. It's wet enough to keep rolling. And the split at a 29.242. Great split. Ruben Hoxima and Jacob Wood pairing together beautifully and really just dialing this up, putting the pressure on all of the guys with eight cylinders. Oh, I can't believe he got a sub-30 split. There he goes. 46, oh. 595. Well done, Ruby. Yeah, that'll put the pressure on the rest of the field in this top six of the unlimited superboats brought to you by Mouthfresh. Ooh. Oh, He's mate, how's down. that afternoon breeze just sending the smell of methadol into the commentary tower? You never have a block nose in this job. No. Guaranteed every time. Even you get the old eyeballs starting to water with the old methanol as she, she comes out. But, hey, that's the beauty. That's what we love about it. Oh, no doubt about that. Look at the Bryant camp down here, just calmly. Young Blake, he's sitting in there. He's got the brolly over him. They're calm as cu cucumbers. Oh. You look look beside him, Sam, Green Eggs and Ham Newdick. He's there. The two big young guns, the top dogs. They're not level, so they can't look at each other, but they're ready to pounce. Oh, uh, as we see, the local man, Dave Simmons, with his daughter Millie launching off the line. Link ECU. And wow, Dave Simmons, this thing really starting to hook up now. Oh, beautiful job. Into the all important PSP hairpin. Oh, great. That is the best we've seen him do that all day. It's the best. He's getting the best out of this boat. He certainly knows his way around his paddock. And it's great to see he's getting some good reliability. Listen to it go. He's hooking up. Pro Charger. Great speed, 29.7. Pretty close to where Ruby was. This is where he needs to bring it home. He needs his strength, a big finish. Have a look at his daughter, Millie. Just got the hand out there. She knows the importance of this run. Oh, got to be caught up in the crosswash. But Dave Simmons with a 46.629. Oh. Straight to the, oh, straight into P2. So Ruben Hoxima quicker than Dave Simmons. Oh, there's a bit of scotting power going on there. Rockstar Ruby, the six banger, still staying in front of one of the eights. Every oh. time he's knocking them out. Jeez, this is... Uh, this is amazing. So Dave Simmons, the local, all right. We, uh, we're just going to wander down here because we've got the girls from uh, Rob and Ange Coley's Poison Ivy. They want to give them a, a go, Dad, uh, and maybe even a go, Mum, this time. But we're going to wait and see. And it is Rob. Here so go. where are the girls? Who are we going to go for? Are we going for Mum or Dad? Both. Both, all right. So yell out, go, Mum, go, Dad. All right, there it is, Robert Edge Coley. Got the support of the youngsters in right behind him. Poison Ivy, she's deadly. Strap yourself in. This will be all or nothing. Rob is now in the place where he needs to be. He will just chuck it at it. He's got his cookies. He's got his speed. Out she goes. Listen to those turbos spooling up. He's into it. Let her rip in the mouth fresh machine. Is oh, on its way. No, oh, way. Rob, no. Rob, 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 what have you done? That's where you needed to go. But he's got pace. So, Rob Coley, he's just had that moment. So, that'll put about another three seconds on the lap. Now, the pressure is really on. Can he race the time away? He will try everything. He was bringing it around. He's sub 30, 33. He's a long way down, a long way to go. But she needs to be a holy moly Rob Coley moment here. He needs to pull everything out of the tracks. And just waving her fist. I don't know if that's in frustration or just the way oh, to go. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't like to guess. Rob Coley east is over the line with a 50.453. Disappointing run. Had trouble in that section of the day, uh, in that part of the track all day because you go in there three times and you come out three times with different 
Yeah. Uh, Wazy, you need to go. I think that motor just cut scruffy. out. Scruffy, the tugboat will be deployed. So uh, I, I don't want to point this out every time, but Rockstar Ruby has just nudged himself up one more spot. So there's another V8. <laughs> Look at Jacob shooter. Wood down there. He's about to celebrate. <laughs> he's just uh, he's giving it a fist bump. Ladies and gentlemen, Leighton Shrek and I. Uh, Leighton Shrek and I. Actually, Leighton and Shrek are still the same person. Yeah, I was going to say. And he's the... Uh, KV and Shrek commentary team <laughs> oh. brought to you. <laughs> yeah, uh, and, and <laughs> brought to you. <laughs> oh, shit, my base pro. Uh, we're going to take a quick break. We're going to catch our breath. But uh, thank you, base pro. We'll be back as uh, Scruffy the tugboat brought to you by Belton Contracting goes out to effect a rescue of the poison ivy machine. All right, we are going wired racing with Aaron Hansen and Julianne Shanks. They've definitely sorted out that jet unit issue. They've just tightened up a few nuts, a few bolts, trying to get the loose nut behind the wheel all sorted in the head now. Well, tights to go. What can he do? Oh, have a look at this out of the block for Aaron Hansen. He knows the top three play opportunity in the top three is on the line. Nice job down at the hairpin. Wide is fully wide and on its way through. He's certainly charging through the course, tidying things up. Looking like a real good run to the little bit knifey right when he got to the split yeah. time. 29 2 2. He's on it. He's on it. He's got a chance of getting in the top three. Yeah, he's driving very hard indeed, really throwing everything at it. The lines are good sometimes. It is a little bit ragged at times. 
but Aaron Hanson and Julianne Shanks across the line there. 45-7-5-6, so Aaron Hanson, Julie Shanks, they are in there, they have made it up there, so at the moment we have got on the bubble, why it looks like, with two boats to go. So I think that was the end of Reuben Hoxima. The six shooter might have just trailed out away, depending what happens here. Well, there you go. So Reuben may need to save up for those other two cylinders as Blake Bryant and Cassandra Norman come off the trailer for Harvest Transport. Bars, bugs, bars, bugs, jam that into the uh, water bottle on your windscreen wipers. It works a treat, really does. Fantastic product. So uh, make sure you get re-hot behind them. So the uh, man from Gisborne, the wife watching at home with baby George going, go daddy, go. Uh, sounds like a website design manufacturing company, doesn't it? But uh, a lot of support there from George. So what can Blake Bryant do? Really wide there, but he's attacking the course. Blake has certainly got those blades working well. There he goes, down to the hip, and this is where he got away last time. Beautifully out of there again. Oh, geez, that was a little bit ugly out of that uh, exit. Uh, ultimately, he was looking good, but then he had a bit of a swipe at it. He so carries a lot more. With fast trucks into the split. How's this going to look, Shrek? Oh, mate, I'll tell you, it's a cracker. 28 5. Oh, he's on it. Cracker. He's on an absolute cracker. So he's letting it up. He knows he's got the speed. He gets. Oh, oh pulled out there. Yeah. That would have cost him. That would have cost Jeezy, him. There was a big deceleration there. Blake Bryant across the line with a 44.7. 44. Oh, my God. Give him a clap, Quick guys. Time. 44.7. And he pulled out and took a gap. Oh, that is unbelievable. He took a breather as he cut the grass at the bottom of the island of the PSP hairpin as well. You saw that, ladies and gentlemen. That was hearts in mouth. So Ruben Hoxima is now on the bubble. That is definitely the end for Dave Simmons with Sam Nudick still to run to work out who's going to run off in the top three of the Mouth Fresh Unlimited Superboats at a 44-7. What a time to pull that out. I mean, the Bryants, the calm. But if anyone is super and calm, it's the smiling accession. It is current NZ1. We know. Look at Sam slowly going through the steering, through the movements. He's, he'll just look for calm water. He's in a sprint tech. He's in the best gear. He's Mr. Calm. He's Sam the man. He's just probably been told. The time that, that you need to beat is a Ruben Oxema of a 46, but Sam is a racer true and through. So uh, he's not going to take it too easy here. He knows he's got a job to do. He's got to know whether he's got all his nozzle changes, his blades right, everything for the final. Now's the time to see. Here he goes. So, ladies and gentlemen, Sam Didik, Sharma Puchanui. So far, this is looking good, but this is what we come to expect from Sam Munich. It is just pure concentration. He knows the boat. He's got faith in the equipment. He knows the setup has been working well every day. The tweaks and changes are thought. They are considered. They are effective. This will be the story, the one we're waiting to find. He digs in and fires her out. 28.6, he's won 100 far slower than what we just saw. So Blake was slightly quicker than that at the split by one one hundredth of a second. What's he got left? What's he got up the case? We wind the clock down, coming round now. Sam Newdick into P2 with a 44.983. So Blake Bryant, 0.283 quicker and uh, so that is how this top three is going to look. Uh, that is the end of Ruben Hoxima and uh, Aaron Hansen, Sam Newdick and Blake Bryant. So ladies and gentlemen, now uh, we have got uh, 12 more runs to go. The top three in the Group B, the top three in the LS, the top three in the Group A and of course the top three in the methanol sucking monsters that are the unlimited superboats.